So, how's my dear mother doing? Are you Glenn Byers? Yes. Who are you? Charles Reed, P.I. The guy taken the fall for your murder. Okay. How did you find me? Are you serious? I'm a private eye. Now don't make this any worse for yourself and answer my questions. Why did you murder Johannes Vanderberg? I had no choice. I am an honest man, sir. I have a family, my, my sweet Evelyn and Michael, her, our son. I didn't want to do it, but they had him hostage. I, I don't even know Johan or whatever he's called. You know who's responsible. Uh, it was a, a gang. I, I'd never seen any of them before. Uh, this guy gave me a gun. Uh, uh, Will, maybe, uh, but I, I don't know if he was anyone special. That's all I know. I swear. Tell me exactly how it all happened. Uh, they broke into our house while I was out. I, I came home and found the broken door. Uh, there were signs of a struggle, but my family... Poor Evelyn. They were gone. <laughs> you never thought to report their abduction. Why not get help from the police? I wanted to call the coppers. I did, but they said... They sent me... Oh, drunk, I can't. It's still on the table. I have no guts to touch it. I'll need to inspect the place where it happened. If you have to, it's next door. I locked it so no one can get in. And so I don't have to look at it again. You and I look rather similar, wouldn't you say? How is that possible? I... I don't know. Uh, this is the face I was born with. I'm just as confused as you are. Do you have any relatives in Boston? Not that I know of. Uh, my family is from Providence, Rhode Island. <sighs> just another of this town's oddities to add to the list. Okay, let's say I believe you. You've done the deed, so where are your wife and son now? I don't know. The gang leader promised they'd be released, but they haven't returned. Please. I realize I'm in no position to ask, but can we make a deal? Depends on the offer. I am guilty. 
I took a life, but you have shouldered the blame. I will turn myself into the police and make this right. When I hand over the weapon, they will have to believe me, but I can't do it until I know my family is safe. Right. So I rescue your family to save my own skin. In a nutshell, yes. So what's your answer? All right, I'll do it. I don't like it, but I'll do it. Thank you. You're a better man than I, Mr. Reed. I'm sorry that I put you in this position, but I will make it right. I promise. There used to be some writing here, but it's been washed off, at least partially. So, the home of a suffragette, huh? but clean and shiny. That's definitely been taken good care of. Crepe silk and lace. Must have been a pretty dress before it was torn. Seems like everywhere I go lately, I find blood. This door will be hard to fix. Some of the boards look fresh. No dust. Who in hell would think to use a spade as a weapon? Oh, wait a minute. Some of the boards look fresh. No dust. Catch up to us when you're done. And don't waste any time rescuing Martin. He's expendable. Open this door or I'll kick it down! Don't you dare touch my mom! I think I'm starting to get the picture.
Open this door or I'll kick it down. Don't you dare touch my mom. Don't you dare touch my mom! Catch up to us when you're done. And don't waste any time rescuing Martin. He's expendable. A gang broke in and kidnapped a mother and son. The latter fought back, knocking an attacker through the floor. And the rest of the assailants left with the hostages. How do I get into the room beneath us? Why? The kitchen? Uh, it's locked. Just give me the key. Fine, fine. Take it. I'll get going. Someone must have had a hard fall here. Glad I'm not him. That's a rare spirit. I'd like you to have a bottle from before Prohibition. Congratulations on your wedding from Sister Peg. Let's see what he's got in here. What am I to do now?
Hi there, Billy. Gotta say, I liked you more last time we met. Same to you, pal. Heard you might be coming, but hoped you wouldn't. So how about this? Leave now, and I pretend you weren't here. Billy, holding a family hostage doesn't suit you. Let them go, and we both walk out in one piece. It's not gonna work out that way. There's a reason the buyers are here. When the time comes, we'll set them free. Why did you need the buyers anyway? What do you get out of it? There are... powerful entities in this Borg. You should know better than to question their affairs. So you best get out while I'm asking politely, Charlie boy. It's Charles. <laughs> you should see your face. <laughs> it's just too easy. <laughs> Billy, I want no trouble for either of us. Byers did what he was asked. So it's time you do your part. For the last time, move along. I already saved your life once. Consider this number two. I get attached to people I save it. Bit of a weakness. But understand this, Charles. I'd hate to kill you, but if I have to, I will. Sorry, Billy. This is bigger than both of us. May the best man win. So this is how it ends, eh? I hoped you might be different. It's a shame you'll die here, Reed. This city has far worse men than you. What the hell? Everything I've faced since coming to this city is on this map. Oh, thank you, mister. I... I thought they'd kill us. I... I don't know how we can ever repay you. Who... who are you? You look... I'm a private eye. And your father's worried about you, too. Father? Is he okay? Did you see him? He's fine, but this isn't over yet. Do you have somewhere you could hide out for a while? Um, yeah, yeah, sure. We'll stay at Aunt Peg's. What's going on? Your father and I have a matter we need to deal with together. He'll explain everything when he can. Okay, okay. Please, mister. Take care of him. 
He's a good man. I'll try. I've got to go. Have you... have you come to save us? Have you... have you come to save us? Still has a wedding ring on. What kind of monster does that? There's a note in the envelope. Your family is safe now. Yes, thank you so much. Uh, my sister-in-law just called to say Evelyn and Michael got there safely. I owe you everything. What happens now? Uh, should I turn myself in? First things first. You need to write a confession. It's your word against the witness. Uh, okay, I I'll take it over to the police station immediately. No, just give it to me. And the murder weapon. You still have it, right? Yes, sir. Here's everything. Good man. I'll go clear things up. I suggest you make the most of your time before the coppers come knocking. I'll get going.
Proof that it was Milton Pierce that killed Johannes Vanderberg. Show me what you've got. The murder weapon is in his house, and a pile of bloody clothes. Here's a photograph. I don't know how you managed to pull this off, Reed, but it's impressive work. We'll take it from here. Accusing a mayoral candidate of murder is an interesting challenge, but the Carpenter family has tackled worse. Bye. You've been doing a great job, Mr. Reed. I'm waiting for you at the Devil's Reef Hotel.